Watch out now, the curtain man gonna get you. Now. Just get your hands off me, curtain man. Sick of you, huh? You think you can just put your hands on me, curtain? <laughs> Please subscribe. Good afternoon, good afternoon, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the channel. My name is Dave Natch, and I speak stocks. Today is Sunday, April the 3rd. Welcome back to another episode of Sunday's Stock List. In today's video, I have one play for you to put on stock this coming week. And also, I'll be giving you the top four highest percentage gainers for the month of March. Let's jump right into it. At number four, at number four, GFAI. GFAI closed up 234% for the month. The stock closed at 173 on Friday. This one is an earnings winner. Last week, the stock made four consecutive higher lows, four consecutive higher lows, okay? This one is in the security and protection space based out of Thailand, GFAI. Sitting at number three, top percentage gainer for the month of March was MULN. MULN closed up 265% at 287. This one is in the EV space based out of California. Quick note, they have 30 million in the float. 43% of the float are shorts. This might be a short squeeze candidate, M-U-L-N. Please take note. Sitting at number two, we have I-M-T-E. I-M-T-E is up 503% for the month. The stock closed at 33.50 on Friday. They garnered a new 52-week 52, 52 high at 38.48 on Friday. The volume on Friday, 2.8 million shares exchange hands compared to their average volume of 800K. This one closed up 7% on Friday, I-M-T-E. Sitting at number one, drum roll please. Let me back up real quick. Uh, I-M-T-E is in the electronics component space and their headquarters out of Hong Kong, I-M-T-E. Sitting at number one, the number one top percentage gainer for the month of March was HYMC. HYMC closed up a whopping 602% for the month. They're sitting at $2.16. This one is in the gold mining space, headquarters out of Nevada. One of the big news was AMC took a stake in the company. Please go ahead and read up on HYMC. MC. Okay? I've been talking about this one since 60 cents. HYMC. Please sit tight for the stock I want you to put in stock this coming week. Do remember if you wish to open a trading account check out my Webull link below you'll get some free stocks. Minimum deposit required is $100. Also, pre-market hours trading starts at 4 a.m. sharp. 4 a.m. sharp with Webull. Webull only the way to go. Pre-market hours trading is very risky. It's not for the risk of birth. Please hammer like. Please subscribe to the channel. Around here we find supernova movers early. Dave's play is the place to be. The purpose of the stock list is for you to do your due diligence on the stock. Check out their historicals. Check out the charts. Read up their current news. Check out their CEO. Okay. And add it to your watch list on your trading platform. And wait for an opportunity to pounce. SGBX, SGBX closed up 12% on Friday at $2.18. If this retracts below $2, that's your buy point. This one could gyrate a lot. For example, on Friday, the low was $2.09 and the high of the day was $2.65. So you see there was a lot of movement on this one on Friday. The company came out with contract news. They gained their biggest contracts so far. Go ahead and read the news on your own time. SGBX is in the metal fabrication space based out of Florida. 
Let's get the tires. They wear a market cap of 24 million. They have 8 million in the float. 19% of the float are held by insiders. 20% are held by institution insurers as 5% of the float, SGBX. Let's continue. They have 37 million in revenues. Their revenue per share is 4.25. <laughs> Their quarterly revenue growth is up 1,435% year over year. Let me repeat that for the folks sitting in the back. Their quarterly revenue growth is up 1,435% year over year. This is SGBX. Their gross profit is 2.2 million. They have a total cash of 3.29 million. Their total cash per share is <laughs> 0 0.28 SGBX. They have a total debt of 3.25 million. Their current ratio is sitting below par. Their current ratio is at 0 0.82. Their book value per share is <laughs> 1.40. Their operating cash flow is a positive 534, 534K. Let me repeat that one more time. Their operating cash flow is 534K. Okay? SGBX. Please go back to your Sunday activities. Don't forget to set your notification for Money Making Mondays tomorrow with Dave Natch. Okay? Enjoy the rest of your evening. I'll see you tomorrow with the plays. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> Dave Natch, I'm out. Boom, bam. Make your next trade your best trade. Be safe out there. I speak stocks. Today is Tuesday, September the 29th. Yeah, dear, yeah. Today my Walmart is streaming. Got a lot of money. Got a lot of money. Invest it in a dear play. Every day. You want your money at? Subscribe to Dear Notch. Foot full gas rich. Yeah, this is Danny B. the Jingle King. I have a little argument for going on. I have a little argument for you know, but you know, I'm find myself with the money and instead I'm squander it and go on with foolishness and go along with You want your money, Arch? Subscribe to Dave Natch. Please, me I tell you, no. go on, go make the money, no, please. Yeah, man, I'm going to do it fast and quick here.
subscribe to Dave Notch fast, don't stop. Every day, you want the money go, check Dave's play. Invest. Interest. Bless. Thank you for watching. Dave Natch, I'm out.